Welcome back to Money Makes. My name is Callie, and today we're going to be making light and fluffy and moist lemon poppy seed muffins. So, these muffins are so simple to make. They're absolutely delicious. They're bright and citrusy and perfect for the spring, summer months, or really any time of year, let's be honest. And I know you're going to love them. So, let's get right into making these muffins. But before we begin, as always, please remember to subscribe, like, share, chat in the comment section, and follow me on social media for more recipes and additional content. So, these are the ingredients that we are going to be using. I have some brown sugar, granulated sugar. I have a little bit of baking powder, flour. I also have, and this is completely optional, a little bit of turmeric. And again, this is optional. The only reason why I'm adding this turmeric into this recipe is to give these muffins um, a more yellow color without actually using any kind of food coloring. But again, this is all for aesthetic purposes, completely optional. If you don't have it, if you don't want to use it, don't add it. So. We have that. I also have some buttermilk, of course, some vanilla, lemon juice. I have an egg, some poppy seeds. I have lemon zest here. I have a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. So again, you have options. I love using extra virgin olive oil in this. I like the flavor that it adds to these muffins. I think it just really complements the citrus and everything else that we have going on in here. However, if adding extra virgin olive oil kind of freaks you out a little bit in a dessert, um, it shouldn't. It's used in plenty of other desserts. I have an uh, olive oil cake that's really delicious and plenty more recipes. You don't have to use it. You can use canola oil, you can use vegetable oil or any kind of um, neutral oil, but I love the depth of flavor that this olive oil is gonna add, so I'm using it and I suggest you do as well. And I have some salt, so that's it. Before we get going, be sure to get your oven nice and preheated to 350 degrees Fahrenheit, and let's get making some muffins. So first things first, I'm gonna grab all my dry ingredients, so my flour, baking powder, my turmeric, and to that I am going to add some kosher salt, kosher salt of course, and then I'm just gonna give this a quick whisk to get everything nice and incorporated. And you know, like I said earlier, just a little bit of turmeric goes a long way. And once you start kind of adding it to the wet ingredients, you're really gonna notice um, the color change. And especially once this bakes in the oven, it's really gonna get nice and bright. And I just think it's really pretty, so. I'm gonna use it. <laughs> Here I have my granulated um, uh, sugar along with my brown sugar. In goes the extra virgin olive oil. So not only is the olive oil gonna add, you know, a subtle flavor, it's not gonna overpower any of the other flavors that we have going on in this recipe, but because it's an oil, it's of course going to make this recipe, these muffins, incredibly moist. So you add in the extra virgin olive oil along with the buttermilk and what you get is just the most moist and fluffy um, muffin. Truly, it's absolutely delicious. And to me, the texture in any kind of baked good is just as important as the flavor. So if you make any of my recipes, know that they are going to be moist. Sorry if you don't like that word, but it's the truth. They're gonna be amazing. So I'm gonna keep breaking up some of this brown sugar, which is a little tough right here, and then we'll continue. Okay, so next up, I'm gonna throw in my egg. And with the egg, we're also gonna toss in the lemon zest. So if you really want to maximize that lemon flavor, what you could do, this is again optional, is you could kind of massage in the lemon zest with um, just your fingers into the sugar. And what that's going to do is it's really going to just kind of release all of the oils in the lemon zest. And it's going to, like I said, really maximize that citrusy flavor in this recipe. So you could do that, of course. Um, but even without doing that, the lemon is really going to pack a punch. So Okay, so next up, I'm gonna throw in my dry ingredients along with my buttermilk and of course my vanilla and my lemon juice. All of that is going in. And so then I'm just gonna mix this up. I'm gonna give it a good whisk until all the ingredients are nice and incorporated and you want to be sure not to overmix the batter. When you overmix the batter, what you're gonna get is a really tough um, muffin and we don't want that. We want them to be really soft and light and fluffy. So I'm just gonna give this a stir and then we'll add in the poppy seeds. Okay, so our final ingredient is of course our poppy seeds. Just mix these in until it's combined. Okay, so here I have a muffin pan that I just lined with some um, muffin tins and you also want to add a little bit of butter or nonstick spray just to ensure nothing sticks. And to this, I'm gonna add my batter. A really easy way to add the batter is to use an ice cream scoop, completely optional, but is really simple. So I'm just gonna line these um, muffin tins with the batter and also be sure to only fill the muffin tins about 
I would say three quarters of the way high. You need to leave some room for expansion as they puff up in the oven. And once I'm done with this, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to pop these into, again, my 350 degree Fahrenheit oven for about 20 minutes or so. Um, you'll know when they're finished when you insert a skewer or a knife into the center of the muffin and it comes out clean or with a few crumbs. So I'm gonna bake these and then I'm gonna give you a close up of just how absolutely moist and light and fluffy and beautiful these muffins really are. muffins that are light and fluffy and citrusy and moist and absolutely amazing. You saw how easy it was to make these and there's no reason why you shouldn't make these at home as well. So as always for the full written recipe and instructions, head to my blog moviemakes.com. I'll put the link for that in the description box below. Click on the link, the recipe will come right up and make these lemon poppy seed muffins. I promise you're going to love them and let me know what you think because I love to hear from you. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.